Hey guys, RC here, back with Football Manager 20, and this is episode 14. We are home on the Range Rovers with Forest Green after last episode with the double loss. Uh, anyway, we played Fleetwood. We got a 2-0 win. Marin Pilge and Aaron Collins with the goals. Wycombe, we beat 4-2. Uh, Gronley, Elliot Freer, Ashley Hunter, and Pilge with another goal. Accrington, we beat 5-0. Aaron Collins put in a hat trick. Uh, Sigurd Gronley with a goal. And Ibu Adams with a relief appearance goal. Burton, we beat 2-0. Elliot Freer and Ashley Hunter with the netters for us. And then we lost 2-1 to Yevel or Yeovil. I'm guessing it's Yevel, just to, just to guess. Because uh, I really don't know. If you know and want to correct me, feel free to put it in the comments. Uh, I'll take it under advisement. Uh, Marin Pills with the early goal, and we gave up two second-half goals uh, to get eliminated from the Leasing.com trophy. Uh, well, that was group stage. So we're still in it. I don't know where we rank. Haven't been paying attention to it. We were supposed to come back for Millwall, uh, but you see that got bumped. Uh, it was a snow-covered pitch. Uh, I believe it. I believe that's what it was, or maybe it was rain. Something happened and it got rained out. Um, so yeah. So anyway, we are back for Barnsley. Taking a quick look at the squad because uh, I like to do that, and I know some of you guys have expressed your thanks. So uh, taking a look at our leading goal scores: Ashley Hunter, seven goals in nine appearances. And then uh, Aaron Collins with that recent hat trick is now on seven goals from 16. Ashley Hunter has really shown up. I think we need to give some consideration to playing him more. Very good determination, anticipation. Concentration is not bad. Determination. I mean, Collins is not any worse. I, I think it would be beneficial to us to possibly have both of those guys on the pitch at the same time. And, I mean, they can play similar positions. The problem is we're playing a 4-4-1-1 a tactic most of the time, and Kai Kennedy is actually really good in that role. Decision-making is, is a little better. Composure. So that's, that's the drawback. Um, I don't know. But I might give Hunter a run of games over Collins just to see chances. I mean, chances created per 90 minutes. I mean, Collins appears to be the better person there. And if we look at Kennedy, 1.43.52. So, yeah, I think I think we, we lose with Kennedy off the pitch. Um on the flip side of that, Kennedy's not our player, so do we do we side with our players here? I, I don't know. Anyway, there's uh, there's your updated stats and everything for us. You can kind of take a look at salaries and expiration dates of contracts if you are so inclined. So we are playing uh, home to Barnsley today. Sounds like the granddaughter's up and about, and she is uh, becoming mobile, so... Uh, it may be uh, sooner rather than later that uh, she makes a camera appearance that her mom will not be happy about. Uh, but anyway, we are in strong form. Uh, four wins on the bounce uh, outside of that uh, most recent loss. Uh, we are favorites today, and there is the tactic that we've been playing. We are at home. We are favored, so we're going to go positive out of that same tactic. That's kind of been... That's the little tweak is I'm going positive and then up to attacking if we're really dominating a game. And then I'm going back to balanced if we're on the road or if we're underdogs in a match. So do we want Kennedy there? I'm going to give Hunter the start. It's going to make uh, – that may upset Collins. We'll have to be careful with that. But it is what it is. Warming up. And as I record this, this is on Friday the 4th. We are a week and a day away from Premier League kickoff. All right, uh, shout out to Tom T., one of my longtime subscribers. He's a, a Tottenham fan. Uh, I just started watching the uh, 
Amazon Prime documentary on Tottenham, and it's really good. Uh, I heard I heard about it on one of the Leeds United podcasts I was listening to this week uh, at work, and um, so Leeds had done one the year before, the year they lost in the playoffs, so year before last, and uh, it's a very good documentary if if you haven't seen it, but supposedly the budget for that was about a million dollars or a million pounds or whatever. Um, oh, nice outlet pass. Shepard on a run. Lays it off to Gronley. Freer. And it went high. Ouch. All right, we need to do better here. Um, but the one for Tottenham allegedly, allegedly, was a ten million dollar budget huge budget that's insane dollars but that just shows the premier league right and as a leeds fan coming into the premier league this year the one thing i took from that watching the first three episodes of that documentary the scoring is pinpoint accuracy in the premier league even by the bad teams which means we need to do a much better job. <laughs> oh, there it is. And Hunter, oh, he puts it off the post. Oh, that was not good. Freer into the box, and it's poked away. Out to Brown. Oh, nice inlet. Hunter. All right, we are going to give a... Uh, a demand more here why are we not showing any stats now oh, hunter with a header on target makes collins lay out for the save okay good defense oh gronley with a nice header good ball on to hunter can he get some support Oh, taken down in the box. Oh, that home. Oppo Halme. Looked like a dive. What an accusation by football manager. Oh, Apo Halme, the former Leeds United player, takes him down. Marin Pills takes the penalty. Sixth goal of the season. And let's, uh, I still want more. I want more. All right, let's pause this. Why is this? This is way down here, right? This should not be customized. This used to be much higher. <laughs> Why is that uh, like that now? Okay. Um... That's weird. I wonder if that has to do with the how much I have the game blown up. But I don't think I've changed this. Let's change it to league table. Let's change it back to match stats. All right, there's got to be an issue in here but i'm not seeing anything that i can click on to resize it all right well let's see 12 to 3 yeah that's that's not good there's nothing it, uh, if you guys know how to fix that please let me know because that's irritating six on target three clear-cut chances we are losing possession i'm not worried about that per se as much as we're dominating the match. All right, well, that's fine. Let's take a look at the tactic. Maybe I want to tweak it a little bit. So when we're in possession, let's take off work into box. Let's take that off. We'll shoot a little more from range. And, uh, oh, you know what? Yeah, we're already doing low tempo. Yeah, all that's already in place. All right, let's get into the dressing room. Prove a point, hand it over. Uh-oh, Hunter is pressured. 
You know, he's playing a 6-5. He's playing a 6-5. Let's pull him. Let's go ahead and put Collins on for the second half. Let's do that. An early subbage. Collins for Hunter, like for like. We're okay with that. Let's get creative. Uh, good save by Collins in net for Barnsley. I am so, so, oh, so excited about next week. Leeds, Liverpool, RC versus Loki Doki. And just like Loki and his subscriber count, we're going to get dominated. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't expect uh, a result from that game. Uh, if we keep it close, you know, if we can keep it within a goal or two, I think I'll be very happy. Uh, we did look pretty good against Arsenal last year, but honestly, Arsenal and Liverpool right now, different animals, man. Different animals. All right, what are we going to do here? Um... Nobody's really tired, but let's go ahead and pull Jaden Brown off for Kitching. We'll make a sub there. Paul May with another foul. Pills. Oh, he curved it. I think there was a save made. Yep, it's going to be a corner for us. Near post. All right, we have got pressure on. Demand more. Ooh, dangerous looking through ball. We got there first, though. All right, Gronley up the flank. Good cross in. Cleared out. Oh, good interception there by McGinley. Bring it right back in the attack. Collins is there, and enough sh pressure on that shot that it bounces off of the keeper, Collins. It's a Collins-Collins rebound goal. Eighth goal of the season, Gronley picks up the assist, and that is excellent. Uh, let's go ahead, tactically, uh, we are going to have the keeper slow the pace down when he gets the ball, and a couple of more minutes, and we will fire off that last sub, which we'll do right now. Um, Adams, Jones, Koval. Let's bring, uh... see, that's the problem. He can't play center. So if we're not playing with the wingers, we're really out of position there. Let's bring Williams on. Let's bring him on for, uh... let's bring him on for Freer. Let's do that. Get Freer a few minutes break. Get Williams a little bit of game time. Rawson picks up a yellow. 23 to 7 on shots. Oh, here we go. Now we can see it. Thank God. Uh, 23 to 7, 11 to 4, 4 to 1 on clear cuts. We did lose possession, but still, I mean, it wasn't horrific. 90% tackles. I'd like to see better heading, but that is a good result. Puts us up into seventh position, just one point behind Lincoln in the playoff chase uh appreciate the efforts good job boys and we will be right back for shrewsbury <laughs> looks like we had the draw for the fa cup we pulled dover in the first round and just a reminder they want us to reach the third round at a minimum so We'll do that. Leasing.com, we, uh, we did lose that one match, but we're still top of the table, sort of, all on goal differential because we're all even. So we've got to be careful there. Uh, we've got to make it to the second round. So we got to got to get through here. Uh, but anyway, let's get to the match today. We are on the road. We are underdogs, both of us in strong form. So let's go ahead here, and we're going to drop back to balance because we're on the road and underdogs. So Hunter on the bench, Pills, White, Gronley, Freer in the midfield, 
Brown, McGinley, Ross, and Shepard, O'Malley on the back, Collins and Kennedy up top. I wonder. I'm gonna. I'm gonna play. Uh, I'm gonna put Hunter. Let's do that. Let's put Collins in at the ten. And give that a run, just to see what it looks like. Just to see how we play with it. I'm always up to tweaking things a little bit. And I always like to give that early shout for creativity. I did not mess with this between matches, just trying to get the recording in. But uh, yeah, this is this is aggravating. Uh, is there something in the settings, maybe? Key highlights, notifications, replays. Yeah, I don't see anything in there that would affect this, so I'm not sure. Not sure what's causing that. Oh, great save by O'Malley. They got through the back line there, but O'Malley kept us in. All right, a corner opportunity. Oh, a couple of rebounds, and Marin Pilge gets a foot on it for his seventh goal. Aaron Collins gets credit for the assist. So that is good. A little bang bang action in the box. And then we'll take a long throw and the keeper gets in front of Ashley Hunter. Hunter with the pressure. <laughs> oh, good first uh, touch there by Goss. Oh, Gronley goes to take it away and cannot keep on the ball. O'Malley makes another nice save. All right, we're dominating. We're dominating. Uh, let's see, what's possession look like? You know what? I am going to go up to positive here. All right. Shepard has won and lost. We've struggled for possession. Bear on. All right, you two guys. Play it calm. And early days here in the second half. Uh, nice ball over the top. Hunter gets on to it. Oh, he tried to dink the keeper, it looked like. Did not get it over. Did not get it over. All right, let's see. So Pills is playing well. I'm going to take Rawson off. Let's bring Kitching in for him. Get the yellow off the back line. Um... I'm going to bring Collins back up top. Hunter, we're going to pull off for Kennedy. That'll be our two subs here. And, oh, Kennedy with a heading opportunity. Uh, you, come on, Kitchen, you need to run faster. What the hell? Oh, good stick. Good stick there defensively but gives it right back. It's not good, not good. All right, finally, just clear it out, thank you. All right, Collins loses it. Freer picks it up, out wide. There you go, good vision. Brown, Freer back to Brown, looking for an inlet. There's a cross in. Header goes over by Gronley. Uh, let's get creative again. Keeper's pressured. <clears throat> yeah, they've only got 37% possession this game. But, you know... I watched enough Leeds games in the last couple of years. You can dominate possession and still give up that late goal <laughs> and lose. Oh, what a shot by Sigurd Gronley. A rocket from the edge of the box. And that is his third of the season. Oh, that was beautiful. Good crossover by White. Nice touch. Just stepped it inside and a bullet. And that should, well, no, I'm not even going to say it. 
Not going to say it. Let's go ahead and make our last sub. Looks, in fact, Gronley. Let's bring George Williams in for him. Get him some rest. Come on, boys. Oh, throw. We go short. We mix it up. Oh, layoff. Crossed in. Oh, come on. Had the opportunity there at the end to like, sneak another one, but it's all for naught. But that's okay. We dominate the game. We get the 2 0 win. Yes, we won. <laughs> We're up into fifth at 27 points, plus 15 goal differential is actually top in the league. So we are charging. All right, guys. Well, let me know if you like what you're seeing. Let me know in the comments below. Let me know what you think of the team's play here lately. And, uh, oh, dressing room, I guess. Good, good. Thank you. And, uh, yeah, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get the notifications for the uploads whenever they happen every four days a week. Every four days a week, uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. Guys, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next episode. Take care. Bye.